Hi everyone, I am so excited to have you join me tonight because do you know what I, you know what we have to do right now? I've got my June boxy locks. So anyway, can you believe this one's the boxy locks? I mean I've had bigger boxy charm base boxes, but you know, it's wicked heavy and never judge a boxy lux until you opened it up and checked it out but you know the most important thing is i have no idea what to do with the items that are in here and that's why i need you guys well i need you guys because well i love you guys and you guys mean a lot to me and i don't think i could continue doing my channel if i knew you weren't there for me so i appreciate you guys so much but when it comes to skincare Hashtag Nancy knows nothing. I mean, I do like getting some makeup in the boxes because it kind of gives you a little burst of colors and maybe it kind of camouflages things. But skincare is really what I need. And I'm and I'm old and I never took care of my skin before. Um, I've had skin cancer a few times. I've had over 300 stitches on my faces. Um, I've had a stroke and so half my face kind of sags on one side and the muscles never came back to pick up and then the other side's got the scars on it so for me the skin care and elasticity is what's really more important so but I don't know what to do with it because it's all like it's, it's, it's like a whole new language yeah and you guys get it and that's why I need you so anyway I hope that you stick around join me as I open this box and then tell me what to do with what's inside Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you stop in and join me and then tell me how to use the items that are in my boxy charm lux. Yeah, but anyway, I just, oh, I'm so excited and so happy that you guys uh, spend a few minutes of your day with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you everyone so much. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos and today we're going to be doing boxy lux and i usually get the boxy charm base box which is 25 dollars um it, they say the average value is 175 dollars and i get five full-size products in there every quarter i get the boxy lux so instead of paying the 25 i pay 49.99 they say the average value for that should be about 395 dollars you get eight full-size products i think i picked out one and um they say the box on the website the value of the box this month some of the boxes could go up to 455 i don't always know how they pick the items that go in everybody's boxes but nevertheless I'm excited to get into it. My box was actually, uh, it took Santa fruit and it went to Indianapolis or Indiana and then yeah, it was there for about a week and a half. It didn't want to leave. It was having so much fun at the post office. But anyway, here it is. Alrighty, so we opened the seal and we are ready to go. And it's, yeah, it's a, it's a little messy inside. Look at this. Yeah. For boxy locks, yeah. Just kind of weird. So we've got this just, you know, we used to get nice color foam and now we just got this crinkle thing sometimes you get this little thing that tells you uh what's in it but as you can see mine mine had a rough ride and it's very very thin i mean yeah i don't know what the difference is if they got a new printer or they're trying to save some money but very very thin dare to dazzle but i do like on the back of it it tells you everything that's in your box it tells you the value of each item and so I am Charlie twenty one zero six four seven zero dash LX. So maybe we have a twin out there. I don't know. So this is going to be kind of hard to read because it's kind of yucky. But you know we're going to give it our best shot. And like I said, the box is small this month, but it, it's heavy. So there's some weighty products in here. Whether that's good or not, I have no idea. But this is what the box looks like. Alrighty, so let's start with something easy because I get overwhelmed sometimes. So this is uh, Milk Makeup. And it's a uh, Kush Eyeliner, Liquid Kush. And I can do eyeliner, so I'm happy with eyeliner. Um... So this um, it's a waterproof, smudge proof, and it's a 
blackest black formula you know and it's weird because sometimes i love black because it kind of sometimes it makes my eyes the whites of my eyes because sometimes when you get old and your eyes kind of look kind of dull so sometimes a black a nice black uh just kind of makes the, the whites pop a little bit and then sometimes it just kind of makes you look old yeah i don't know maybe it's frame of mind i'm not going to open it because i don't want to i want to keep it fresh but i know that i will use this in fact i just uh opened a black liquid liner today and used this morning so i'm excited for this this has a 22 dollar value so that's pretty cool Alrighty. so next we have this uh, nars thing so this is a blush from nars and i guess maybe that is the color orgasm and this has a $30 value it says it's a cult favorite it's a best-selling blush and matte so a nice small compact might be a trick to opening it Okay, I got it. Alrighty. So, um, I don't think it's coming out too good, but it, uh, in person, it's a, it's a lot brighter, but I think it should be a pretty decent shade for me to kind of highlight my cheeks and a little NARS thing. So, I think that's a nice little thing to have. You can always use a nice blush, and this has a $30 value. Alrighty, next we'll get out of we got a uh, palette here but we'll save that for later and we have pure hearts it's a real rose petal sleeping mask and i have since and i owe it all to just nina because i never masked before i mean i knew people did it and i heard people talk about it but i yeah i didn't do that like I said, I'm really new to the skincare thing. And um, I was watching Justine, and I'd watched a few of her videos. And she does, you know, she was always doing her Monday morning mask, even before it became a phenomenon on a Facebook for, I mean, uh, YouTube for everybody to do the uh, Monday mask. But she was one that was doing it uh, way back then when I first started watching. And one of her videos, she did a giveaway of 11 sheet masks, and I happened to win. So, yeah, and that got me going on the mask and then getting into the skincare because I didn't get any of these boxes before. And so the monster that I am now, that's from Just Nina. Yeah, she's a wonderful lady. I hope you check her out if you haven't. But anyway, so this mask. Oh, and it smells. It's like a bouquet of roses. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a kind of gel consistency. But just move around a bit so if I drop it, I'm sure it's going to fall out. Oh my gosh, this smells nice. I am going to use this tonight. So, sleeping mask. It says the sleep mask contains real rose petals and rose water to moisturize and revitalize your dry and stressed skin while sleeping. Alrighty. So that sounds really good. This has a value of $55. And it does come with like one of these things so that you... Uh, don't contaminate it yeah this smells really nice I am going to love using this this smells nice and again this had a $55 value so not bad I'm happy so far yeah I got three super items love getting good things here alrighty so what the heck is this this is Elemis and I know this is supposed to be a good brand but I don't really know too much about it but I know people get excited when they see it and it's a superfood, aha, glow cleansing butter with a pumpkin, some kind of cherry and mango butter. It cleans, brightens, and nourishes. And like I said, I enjoy the skincare more than makeup. So this is right up my alley. And I want a superfood. So this says melt away makeup and daily impurities while leaving the skin looking healthy, fresh, and glowing. So this is a new launch. So this is maybe something that's going to be everywhere. I don't know. Seems to me to have pumpkin. Oh, was it fermented pumpkin? 
an enzyme so does that mean it's moldy but anyway this is 38 dollars i was excited till i read the fermented i should i should never read yeah well if it smells yucky i'm not going to use it but if it smells okay then i will it smells okay okay i'll use it maybe i don't know okay so it's, it's weird it's like you see how it's packaged here it's i mean it's just kind of settled and it didn't like leave a film or anything so that's kind of weird right i don't really smell anything but i'm not sure about the cap and maybe it, okay it's just words i saw that kind of black in there and i thought maybe it was mold but unless the mold learn how to make itself go into letters yeah i think this is okay I don't think mold knows how to put itself into the numeral 12. Alrighty, I'm excited again. $38 for a nice cleansing butter. Okay, I'm on board again. Yeah, I get scared easy. But then I get calmed down too. Okay, I think I saw something from Earth Harbor in another box that I had recently. Earth Harbor. No, it's for hair. Okay. And I think the last time I thought it was a serum for skin and it was for hair too. Yeah, so maybe that's all Earth Harbor does. So it says it's um, Earth Harbor Naturals Sunstone Hair Revive Elixir. Revitalizes and nourishes dull hair. It's got jasmine, some kind of calendula flowers, ultra rejuvenation. It's got carrot seed, jojoba oils. It says massage into scalp to promote energy to hair follicles and envelop hair in a crowning aroma of fruit, flowers, and fresh earth. Okay, that sounds really nice. So this has an MSRP of $30. And um, let's see if it smells. It has a nice fragrance. Very mild from what it said. I thought it was going to be like, oh, enveloping my hair with the chasmins. But just a nice oil. Very mild. I mean, it's, I'm sure once you put it in, if you rinse it out, you're not going to smell it. But, oh well. I'll give it a try. I'm excited to try that. So this has an MSRP of $30. And we have another Dr. Brandt, and I think people liked Dr. Brandt too. So it says triple antioxidant face cream. Visibly smooths wrinkles and helps prevent signs of aging. So I'm sure it's going to tell you a little bit of what's in it. Let's see ingredients, which is over my head. Alrighty, Dr. Brandt. It says this antioxidant enriched moisturizer provides skin with 12 hours of protection, protect, protection from damaging free radicals and external aggressors. It's formulated with a revolutionary A3 power, a dynamic shield boosted antioxidant anti-stress ingredients that preserve a youthful appearance. Alrighty, this is a new launch and this little thing here has an MSRP of $64. $64. Oh, it's sealed. So I will leave it sealed so it stays nice and fresh. And this is part of the Pride Month, I guess. With Pride, say I love you. Alrighty. Alright. So I'm excited about using some skin cream, some $64 skin cream that I didn't pay $64 for. Alrighty, now I've got another face mask, but this is Wicked Light. Okay, for Superfood, Superfood face mask with Rishi, Dietary Supplement. So it's a face mask, but you eat it like a vitamin. Purify inside and out. 
I think they're just messing with me now. You're holding a face mask made with real superfood. It's so pure you can eat it. Use every two to three days as a clarifying face mask. It's organic and it's edible. What does this say? Oh my gosh, this is this is just too much for me. So it's 20 calories and it tells you what's in it. And it's packets is it's not a pill. It's got so do you mix it with something and eat it and it's supposed to mask your face from inside? Okay, I'm gonna yeah. This is over my head, people. What does this say? Four sigmatic. This purifying face mask is made with real superfood. Relax while you clarify your skin two to three times a week with a mask that smells like brownie butter. And it's $40. If anyone has this, what do you do with it? Do you just throw it out and not worry about it? Yeah. I'm so confused. Is it a vitamin? Is it not a vitamin? Is it, is it a mask? <sighs> I'm too old for this. Alrighty, I think this is my last item. Thank goodness, because, yeah, that, yeah. I say something positive for the end. Okay, Smashbox, Cover Shot, Golden Hour, Eye Palette. Alrighty, I can get on board with that. That was, yeah, that was, I don't know what to do with that. Okay. Alrighty, so it's a cute little compact. Put something in the back. Maybe it tells me what the. Uh, well, I don't know if that's going to focus or not. But ooh, it's like a magnet. You just kind of open it and it closes quick on you. You know, this would keep me entertained for hours going to film over the mirror so I don't think it's going to blind you but these are the shades so they are pretty they're like purple some maybe taupey some goldish tones so it looks like it could be a nice everyday palette maybe fall over here and more spring and summer over here but it does look interesting Smashbox what does it tell me about that so it says it's a high impact powder eyeshadow palette with two base shadows and a curated mix of six different colors and different formulas and finishes. Cream your own mesmerizing looks on the go for the most on trend colors in a snap. So this has an MSRP of $28. So I think I'm going to use this. It kind of looks like it's colors I'm, I can get on board with. I went a little darker today, but you really can't tell. I got blue on, but yeah, you can't tell. But yeah, so that is everything in, in my box. I think I got, other than that face mask, that I don't know, is it a mask or is it a vitamin? Do you put it on your face? Do you eat it? Do you mix it with something? That's the only thing I'm really confused about, but everything else is pretty exciting to me. So that's my box. So I got the uh, brownie mix or a fudge mask. The rose petal sleep mask, which this smells amazing. I am going to use that for sure. I got the Dr. Brandt Triple Skin Cream. Sounds really nice moisturizer. The Earth Harbor, the oil for your hair and follicles. The Elemis Cleansing Butter for my face. That sounds really nice. The Smashbox Palette for the eyes. Really pretty colors. The Nas Blush Palette, that looked really, really nice. And I forgot the brand, the Milk Brand Coal, uh, the Liquid Eyeliner. So that's the eight items that I have, and I did quickly add everything up somewhere. So anyway, they say the average value should be $395.
They say some of the boxes this month came up to a total of 455. I fell a little short because probably the stupid face mask. But uh, yeah, so mine comes up to $308. But $308 for spending $49.99. And I'm going to use probably everything in this mask. If someone tells me oh, how to use this face mask right here, I would probably use it. Otherwise, it'll... I don't know if I would even put it in a giveaway if I don't know what to do with it. Um, is that fair to do something like that? Or do I just throw it in the trash if it scares the crap out of me? I don't know. But that, anyway... So anyway, thanks you guys for stopping in and visiting with me and my crinkled up little thing. But yeah, so anyway, it's a lot of fun. I got some great products in here that I am really going to love trying. And I appreciate your comments, your help. Your help is needed. As you can tell, yeah, hashtag Nancy has no idea. But thanks so much for joining me. Um, I look forward to your comments. I hope you go out and have a great day. We'll chat again soon, everybody. Bye-bye. Oh my god, I'm gonna yawn. Oh my god, I'm gonna yawn. Right, now my eye hurts. Hi everyone, I'm I'm gonna start over because that was like boom right in your face. One. <laughs>